Right, folks, this is Contra. Game out on... Um, it's on all the main platforms at the moment, but it's reduced down to a, just three quid. It's a Contra selection, okay? So you've got Contra, which came out in 1987 in the arcade, and then it goes through to Super Contra, which is, again was in the arcade. Then you're on NES versions. This one here is Super Contra Super C, which is effectively a rebranded version of um, Pro Protector 2 Return of the Evil Forces that I played, see another video above, and then they've got some ones that came through on the SNES and the Genesis as well. So we're going to start on the very first one, which is the arcade version. We're going to go on normal difficulty, and um, as you can see, look at this. Doesn't it look strange? So this would have been in the art, please deposit coins. Right, I'm in. Oop. So right away, com even compared to just the home console versions on the NES, the controls are very clunky in comparison. This game would have gobbled up your 10p's back in the day. You just know it. There's just so much stuff going on. Of course, this is one of the games where the um, television was effectively on its side in the cabinet. So, so that's how it used to be back in the day, wasn't it? Don't like this. Remaining. On the way. Come on. Right, through the first section. Whew. This is, I thought was going to be a quick review then. A little sub level by the look of it. I don't know what's happening here, so I'm just going to fire. Oh, I can move forward. Look at this. Oh, look at this. Look. There's a little map on the top, and I can go up. What happened there? Continue. Okay. Oh, no way. Even the high school thing's clunky on this. So there you go, that is in 1987, brought out by Konami, of course, bring out all the best games you've ever seen. So that is Contra on the arcade. Catch you guys on the next Contra flip side. I couldn't have said it better myself.